Burn notice the fall of Sam Axe, short movie review. Sam is facing an informal inquiry because a mission in Colombia went completely out of control and they're trying to figure out why. And he was there to help protect this hospital for doctors without borders, which I guess they couldn't say, so they called it Doctors for Everyone or for all, some, something like that, where he encounters Nikki of Nikki and Paolo from Lost, who plays a very similar, like she's, she's very snarky and some are going to find her really annoying in this, even obnoxious. Personally, I, you know, it fits with the burn notice thing. The, the characters, the major characters do tend to have this kind of snarky and Having really liked her in a perfect getaway, I was, you know, I didn't go into this hating Nikki from, for being Nikki and Paolo lost, and yeah, it, it really fits, and she's, she's pretty funny, and yeah, she's basically a charity aid worker, and then there's also this doctor at the hospital, and yeah, he has to protect them, and things go in, in unexpected directions, of course, and there's, you know, guerrilla warfare, and yeah, the, the, the action is really good, there are some nice explosions, and, you know, some, some stunt work, and such. It is on somewhat of a smaller, not, not scale, but budget, than most of the show, and I, I personally found that it's it's very much a Bruce Campbell film where he plays Sam Axe more than a Burn Notice film starring Bruce Campbell and, as Sam Axe. And personally, I really enjoyed the whole... I'm, I, I like Bruce Campbell's shtick. So, so I enjoyed that, but at the same time, there are some very serious situations that he approaches with this goofy shtick and considering how different it is from the tone of the show I, I feel like that that hurt the, the tone some and they also make him really casual with these superior officers which just really doesn't feel like the Sam Axe of the show although on the whole, that is very much, it is that same character. Now, you can watch this without having watched the show, and it's, you know, as a prequel, it's not the kind that feels like it has to explain everything, though there are a couple of really cool little details in there. If you like this review and want more detailed one, the link is in the description box. Please comment, thumbs up, and subscribe for more content.